Okay, still using paint up the good old white, the titanium white by Artina, which I buy direct from Germany. It's a bit cheaper than Amazon. And some blue. Bit of yellow. In fact, I put uh, quite a bit of yellow in there. I'm going to use a green. And a red. Which is also the Artina make. I like these paints a lot because, um, especially the black and the white, they have uh, lots of pigment in them and they cause cells, as you probably know. If you don't, black and white cause cells, <laughs> the pigment in them naturally cause it. I just put a drop of this pink in as well. Just going to pause the video because I need to clear the white out. Okay, so I'm back in with the white. That's much better. You have to wash these bottles if you don't keep them clean or airtight using one of these caps. You get these horrible bogies in it and basically they stick on your paint you finish work and then you've got to pick them off and it's yeah not nice so right I'm going to try this I pour on this now just give it a swirl in fact I'll put a touch of black in it just to break the colours up a little not much in there because you don't need too much black Black goes a long way. Right, just check that's in frame. Yep, that's perfect. Right, so I'll just do a flip cup. People say you shouldn't let the drips go on the painting, but what the heck, it gives it like a bit of a cell look. If you're struggling with cells, just, just add it a little bit. Artistic license, that's where it is. There's no rules. So, just give it a pour. I'll just try and get some of that green over there. Then pull it back a little. See if we can create a bit of a swirl in this pattern. That's it, all covered. Right. I'll just turn the camera off until I'm ready to uh, torch it. Not much happened in the five minutes that were away. Um, just a cell there and a cell there. So, need some fire. Much different. 
it's still got the pustly, pustily shade to it, uh, the pinks and the blues. Alright, let's uh, have a close up.